I'm Helen Lederer. I've been around for a while. I was a stand-up comedian in the 80s. And here I be with my books and my new white hope, my white, red and black hope. I don't have a book as such today as we speak, but I'm working on a multi-platform thingy me bops, which is Be In The Now. And as an actress, I'm gonna be doing the show at Christmas hopefully the Christmas book, I'm <laughs> sounding like a car, a car salesman, the book could well be out at Christmas. And I play a, Be In The Now is a kind of spin on Urquhart Toll's The Power Of Now. So it's a kind of combination of who I was, my name, a comedy spoof exploiting failed celebrityism and um, the need to be happy. It will work, it's multi-platform. What inspired me was um, I wanted a, a new hook to do my work and this book, Coping with Helen Ledger, was a sort of antidote in a way almost a, to Bridget Jones. It was kind of like, and people have been very excited about it, it's kind of like how to live your life in a kind of ironic way. Um, an antidote to the Jay Nasher easy entertaining kind of genre. Um, of the 80s and this is the the now version being in the now is the now version of that and it's a minority sport but once you get it I think it has something to say I get my inspiration from looking around I've just come back from a program called a celebrity coach trip and you just have to look at how human beings behave particularly in this sort of mantle of the need to be a celebrity at the moment, which has changed its goalposts, obviously, and it's real. It's not useful to say it's wrong. I mean, it's around us. So it's just interesting to see where manipulation and bullying and the need to be out there has taken over from, I'm sounding like an old bag here, but maybe having like, being able to tap dance or something. Well, my favourite dirty secret actually stems from tonight, where I found a book where an amazing photographer invited people back and filmed them without any clothes. And I've made some very good friends. And this is a dirty secret. I've just seen some really large penises, which are just like strange and unusual, um, all in a lovely coffee table book. Now, I think that is genius. So I suppose I'm combining the word dirty and secret and cleverness all in one there. Um, but when you do these so-called celebrity programs, I've never ever done a reality show before and you're supposed to not say anything and they've got all this PR behind them so they make a great big hit. My problem is I don't belong to that generation, to this current generation of believing that it's gonna change my life. But hey, who knows, it might. Tonight is a wonderful night. I'll tell you why, because the people are gems. Uh, you go into a room, you can talk to them. Everyone's artistic, interested, kind, uh, generous. Um, these people make up a good evening. And Jason and his wonderful co-host have actually put this night together. And it's very unusual and very strange. And I've actually, I know that I've made uh, a lot of friends, a lot of new drinking partners, in a good way. Terrific, thank you so much for the interview. And we know you're in a hurry and you've got to go and catch a train. Be in the now, Twitter. Be in the now, Helen Ledra, please do this.